Top British officials met this afternoon to discuss concerns that a bomb may have been responsible for the downing of a Russian plane over Egypt. All 224 on board died in the crash. Now, this comes as ISIS continues to claim it was responsible for taking out the plane. David Martin is at the Pentagon. David, thanks for joining us. What have you learned from the U.S. intelligence? Well, uh, you read that statement from, that the uh, British put out. They said a, uh, an explosive device, quote-unquote, may well have brought down the plane. And I asked a U.S. official uh, if the, the U.S. Uh, intelligence reports that are coming in agree with that assessment. And he said, we agree with the British assessment. But everyone I've talked to says that still leaves two possibilities. One, a bomb aboard the plane planted before it took off from uh, Sharm el-Sheikh in the Sinai. And two, a catastrophic failure once it had reached altitude. And uh, the officials I've talked to uh, say there is no hard evidence one way or the other on that. Uh, it's known that an explosion occurred because it was picked up by a satellite which detects uh, sudden infrared uh, uh, explosions of heat. And <clears throat> but nothing yet from the uh, black boxes or uh, a forensic uh, study of the uh, wreckage that's uh, being picked up off the desert floor that I know of has confirmed uh, either of the two theories. If it was a bomb, of course, ISIS would be the leading suspect. Uh, for one, uh, it's active in the Sinai. It's conducted other terrorist attacks in the Sinai. Uh, two, it has uh, claimed credit. And uh, three, it, uh, it would have a, 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 a motive in, in that uh, Russia has uh, openly claimed it has begun bombing uh, ISIS targets, although the, the facts of the matter are that uh, very few of the uh, Russian uh, airstrikes in Syria have uh, been against uh, ISIS targets. Well, one thing uh, U.S. intelligence has done is uh, go back and search all of what they've collected on ISIS uh, over, the, uh, over the months that uh, this war against them has been going on and uh, look for any sign that ISIS showed interest in attacking a, uh, a, an aircraft belonging to whatever country. And uh, I, I was told that as of this morning there had been one reference uh, found to ISIS expressing an interest in uh, placing a bomb on a plane, and that that uh, source was uh, uh, not considered uh, particularly reliable, and uh, the report was not corroborated by any other intelligence uh, reporting. So, uh, I, th I think most people uh, in U.S. intelligence are uh, sitting on about 50-50 between those those two possibilities: a catastrophic uh, malfunction or a a uh, bomb placed on uh, on the airplane. David Martin reporting from the Pentagon. David, thank you very much. Sure thing.